Um, well, I know that women would get, particularly in the United States, would get an equal salary for an equal day of work, which I think would be good, considering that not only do they do um, uh, work outside of the house, but they do 80% of the work inside of the home in a, in a traditional family structure. Um, so I think it would be nice to see women equally compensated for their professional capacities. Um, that would transform the position of women in the United States. How would the world be transformed by women such Women already control 80% of America's economy and purchase decisions. Everything from what kind of cereal their kids eat in the morning to what kind of car they buy. Men control a few things, usually like what stereo to get and what television. But all the rest of an, Amer of an American household's um, uh, budget and, and discretionary spending, or not even discretionary, but spending, is, is determined by the woman in the house. Is that possibly going to increase uh, competition for resources that we just dealt with in the last question? It doesn't mean they're consuming more. I'm just saying which okay. part of the household income that they okay. have control over. So how would it be transformed if men and women were treated as equals? I don't know. I think it would be really interesting to find out. I think that uh, throughout, the, throughout the first world, there is almost that equality. Oh, please. No, there is. I, it's it easy then, to say it, that from where you sit it then, with, it your, then depends, with your guidance. It, 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 then, it, then depends, it then depends upon what women choose to do with it. And I, and I, and I, do, think that, uh, I, I do think that we have even more fundamental issues to deal with, it, within which I think women will uh, acquire more equality along the way. I mean, race is uh, race and class are uh, acquire are, more equality. Why yeah. aren't we equal from the get from the start in perspective? I mean, why well, do we have why do we have to acquire it? I don't. I, so I why aren't we just granted that? In my in, in my in my in my own being, I don't see I don't see a disparity between men and women. In my own being, I don't treat women any as you know. I don't treat women any differently to men, with give or take a few. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I, I think, I think most, I think most men in uh, in in uh, first world northern democracies are pretty much like that. So when we were in Baghdad and we went up to that unit that was doing the house search that we ended up filming. Yeah. How come I was the one that was sent to ask the question of whether we could film them? How Be come I was the one that they asked? What are you doing here? They didn't ask you that question. Because, they asked me that question. Because you were in a better position. You were in a better position to be able to do that job. No, they were. A they were asking me why I was there because of my gender. Okay. If 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 somebody had <laughs> as if as if I as a woman journalist didn't have the same right or expectation to be in that environment as you did. That's not the, okay. I think you if, just don't see it. If we, if, 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 there, if there, if there was a situation or where, it, if there was a situation where fifty kilos had to be lifted up off the floor and carried across the street and put in the car, they'd probably look at you. Right. Right. And so would you. So my answer and is so that my you. answer is that as long as these inequalities exist, which I think they always will, and it's a perception issue. Um, I find my um, my interests best served by. Um, by uh, uh, taking advantage of them to my to my interests to my to what am I trying to say by um, leveraging them and those inequalities or those perceptions of inequality leveraging leveraging them to improve my capacities and skills as in if there is um, a man who believes that I have no power because of my gender or I have no capacity to influence because of my gender let him believe that as long as he wants. Um, I will use it for my for my ends and for my uh, to, to as an advantage in my professional capacity as a journalist um, to collect information and and understand the situation better. That his his misconception of my gender role or my gender strength is his fault, not mine. And so what you're saying is that you don't actually want equality, and to be treated equally for you is infuriating. That. No, I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is that as long as that reality exists. I'm not going to let it be my weakness. I'm going to use it as a strength. And therefore, you desire it. No, not at all. You don't. So no. you would. So you would prefer to lose that strength. Yeah. Okay. There we have it.